Okay, people, we just did a review on my main channel, Dutch, and she uh, gifted Ramesh a piece of land, completing him to own all of the main um, thing, whatever, on Campbell's Boulevard in Kingston. And it was a good gesture. I didn't even um, say anything bad about it, you know, but it looked like the people out there are, you feel what I'm saying, and they're accusing the observer of being on the payroll for Ramesh. Yes, you heard it right. We uh, revealed that the other day that the journalist from the Observer was in some cuss cuss with some people over some some article that got put out, you know, and the journalist was in the comment section basically cheerleading for Shinsia. And these are the correspondence um between the individual and the um Observer you, so people, when me tell you, say people, they're upon the payroll, I don't know, believe me. Yeah, you know I mean, but me not call the names, they say, me, I say, but I don't just believe me, you know. I know this article is causing up stir because the Observer, once again, um, did a review about Shenzia gifting Ramesh, um, the piece of land, but what's causing the problem is the word philanthropic. You know what I mean, or however you um, pronounce it, you know. And the people them saying this is not a good gesture because Ramesh is not in need of anything. Remember, I'm just a messenger. Don't crucify me unless you won't get no more messages. As you see the individual comment, bro, who writes these captions? <laughs> this is not an act of philanthropy. Ramesh is not a person in need of anything. Being a philanthropist is given to people in need. Please just admit that it's a flex, not an act of philanthropy. And somebody responded, thank you for saying this, my exact dogs. They need to do better with their captions. And you would think that they're talking about me, but the individual said this again. I mean, nothing is wrong if she want to do that. But whoever writing these captions are the dumb as F or just want to paint lies to people. <laughs> you see? I guess it's not just me, the one making these ridiculous headlines. <laughs> but me never claim to be no journalist. You see me, I say, why, 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 why? People putting out a comment section, what do you think about um, the article using the word philanthropic, you know? Um, a lot of people is saying this is just a, a ploy to keep people talking about her album. You feel what I'm saying? Because it flopped internationally wise speaking you know we can't compare with nobody else locally because nobody locally now get the type of um big boy advertisement um shensi i get you see me i say also ramesh is upset that they use that picture because i don't know what's so negative about that picture you know um if you want shensi it's just you know, good friends, you know, you adopted her son. So what's wrong with the picture? What's wrong with a dad holding his daughter's hand like that? You know, we know you have a girlfriend in the picture now and all of these things. But let's be honest, you should be glad that you have any pictures with any of these types of female because you wasn't doing that 10 years ago, you know. So nothing wrong with the picture, you see me, I said, but people have a problem with this. Is the bossing and hyping for no reason, you see me, I say. But anyway, we just I give you that update from Wagwan from Wanataguan, you see me, I say. And now, I want to update you on this story that we um, did a review. I think it was a couple of weeks ago, you know, a Jamaican um, was shot um, because a lady said that he was standing too close to her while online buying donuts from Dunkin' Donuts, you see me, I say. You know, this six feet business got a lot of people paranoid, you know, but she claims that he was also disrespecting her, you know, and she made a call to her boyfriend, allegedly, who tracked him down and exchanged words. And, you know, he was shot in the process, you know what I mean? Well, they arrested Satiana um, Rodriguez, if you hear what I'm saying, in connection with murder. You know, her boyfriend is still at large. Um, the police have a feeling that he um, did the crime, you see me, I said, boy, it's a sad situation because that youth had just come from Jamaica three months prior and was working in a restaurant to take care of his two sisters and mother back home at the island. Chano, Chano, you think so, you're that safer abroad, but 
People are better to understand the yard, you know. The world is not like how it used to be one time, and people them is real, boy. But me glad said justice is moving forward, at least his family um, can get some type of closure, you know. Um, I know nobody is not allowed to be shot on these streets of New York, so hopefully the family can get a little a thing, you know what I mean? But um, it's just crazy, you know. And that's why it's better you just... Why, why, why? I'm just like giving an update from our guan, from another guan, you see me? Why, people? I mean, I lie. This is a sad story right here, you know. You know, sometimes when enough to play here and let the law um, do what the law do, you know. But sometimes you have to take these type of laws into your own hands, you know. So, when you now go upon these type of works for find gunmen and rapists and all of these things, just make sure you're prepared like Babylon, you know. And, you know, police officers have them bulletproof vests and all of these things, you know. But I have some people broke into a bar, you know, sexual assault is the bartender. And, you know, take all your money and equipment and all type of things, you know. So, you know, one of the men identified by the relatives, 37 Michael James, is said to have been killed after he and a resident went in search of gunmen following a robbery at a bar in neighboring um community of Hamptons sources identified the second victim of Courtney Smith you know you know this thing happened three o'clock in the morning you know we hear said them two individuals yeah, that passed away um was killed a mile apart you know Rashane that you see on the right told the observer following the robbery residents from Smithfield and um some other places launched a manhunt for the gunman you know before the brother them was killed, them recognized one of the man, you know. That's a sad situation, people. I'm not lying to you, but I'm just like you and Bob did. But I'm going from what that I'm going, you know. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to get notified when I drop the latest in dancehall news, music, or views, and gossips. Bless.